Yeah, I mean, like, there was there was one year where there there was a family that came over that I hadn't ever met before, and they introduced me as the anime cousin to this kid, <laughs> who was very much going through an emo phase, and very much denying that they were having an emo phase. <laughs> Yeah, literally, like, imagine, imagine being introduced at Thanksgiving as, this is the anime cousin. <laughs> it's, um, you know, so I was, I was being very nice, and, uh, but, like, then I was like, oh, so you're, like, an emo kid. Not, not meaning it derogatory, that's just what we called ourselves back in the time when we were going through, like, that phase. And, um, they freaked out at me, and they are like, I'm not emo. And I was like, well, since when was being emo a bad thing? Wait a minute. <laughs> but apparently the, the Gen Z demons do not like being called emo. So I have to take notes, apparently. I was very lost. Uh, very lost on what was happening. <laughs> it wasn't even seen. They were just like full on emo, like all black. Outfit, like, yeah, I was in shambles. Magic, thank you very much for the Zupa. Yeah, I should have called them Chuni, but I don't know if they would have known what that was. Because, like, they themselves weren't that into anime. But they were just glad to have someone else who was weird, I guess. Uh, and, like, cool and older. The faction, thank you for the Zupa. You can just walk on- oh, okay.